I started this this particular series of videos uh, on the role of limitation in, in life, the kind of the redemptive role of, of limitation in life by talking about the way limitation forces me into a corner where, in which I, I, I have to choose what I'm doing and therefore I get to then be fully present to what I'm doing as opposed to like wonder what it would be like to be able to do everything or let the things I can't do take away from the things that I'm actually doing. So embracing limitation means that I get to be fully present to the things that I'm doing. Another another way limit the, the, like embracing my own limitation has been a redemptive practice for me is that it means that I've been able to be more present to other people around me. Um, uh, actually, an example that isn't exactly about me, but uh, re recently having a conversation with a young woman who had a really great idea for a pretty elaborate project, but didn't know. Uh, how to get it started. She didn't have the resources, didn't have all the time. It was a great idea, but she the, she came to me saying like, hey, this is the thing I want to do. I don't I don't know how to do it. So she's embracing this limitation. And she'd already taken like a first step in letting someone else in by talking to me about it, saying, hey, this is an idea that I have and I don't know how to do it and inviting me into that, that space and saying vulnerably, you know, can you help me? So now I get to play a role in her life. I get to say like, well, hey, I, I, I don't have a lot of time energy and resources in that direction, but I actually have some friends who do, because that there, there aren't really many, if any, uh, fully original ideas, and so I knew some other women and men who were doing some similar things, and I connected her to those folks, and she's had apparently some really great conversations with them about what they're doing. So what, the limita what, the, what embracing limitation did for her is it allowed me to play a role. Not only did it give her the opportunity to, to share her dream, to share her thoughts with someone else, which is a way more enjoyable way to live life rather than doing everything on your own, but it also gave a whole list of people like this really cool opportunity to give themselves away, including myself, to give themselves away in the way that like they're equipped to do. I love helping people. And she gave me the gift <laughs> of helping her by letting me into her process, which first began with embracing her limitations. Limitations is not just a way to, to focus on the things that I'm doing so that I can be present to those things and not be worried about what I can't do, but it's also a way as a practice to include, to redemptively include others in my life and process.